Welcome to Candy Bar or Game, the show where I go on a Steam and check out the cheapest possible games and decide whether or not it's worth your time and money, because that Snickers bar sure does look good. So you got two dollars to spend, huh? Cheap and broke, it's that time of the month again, game or more junk, but running into cheap Steam games you will definitely find a lot of junk. Today's episode is a game called Bit Blaster XL, a 46 cent Steam game that packs a lot of punch for under half a dollar. Back when I was a kid, I loved going to the arcade and bowling alleys or playing my Super Nintendo at home. 2D space shooters were the absolute bomb, no pun intended, and Bit Blaster XL holds up to my childhood and brings back the badass 2D space shooting within a confined area and hits you with nostalgia and a great catchy soundtrack. I mean, just listen. So let's go over the pros. This game runs off potato hardware. Seriously, if you can't run this, then you probably shouldn't have Steam installed on your system. It's only a 37 megabyte of download space. If you're seriously into saving hard drive space, this is the game for you. It has catchy music and graphics. The graphics are so clean and crisp. The music is great and catchy with a retro feel written all over its soundtrack. Controller support is here, and it's very simple and an easy game to play. Although it can get quite challenging. Everything is very satisfying, from blowing up space junk and getting blown up by bombs and space junk and lasers. It all hurts. This game can also be challenging at later levels, and it's an easy time waster for only under half a dollar. And now with any good game, we still have things we wish they had. The controls can be quite difficult to master, and they aren't the easiest, that's for sure. I find myself struggling still to get used to them, and it's hard for me to even get past 10,000 score. Yeah, I know I suck. There is no multiplayer. Yeah, this is a stretch, but even with local multiplayer, this game would be insane and filled with so much more action you can get out of it. And other than just shooting things and blowing things up, that's all you do, hence the name Bit Blaster XL. But maybe I'm just asking too much out of a 46 cent Steam game, although it's still worth all the pennies that I bought. So that's pretty much it guys, Bit Blaster XL on Steam for 46 cents. I think today, I'll choose that game, and save up for a candy bar in the meantime. Don't forget to like and subscribe as it does help me out put more video for you dudes, and I will see you in the next episode.